What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course C and Puma and wherever you may be, however you may be watching, thanks for making this video a part of your day. In the last one, your boy, C and Puma became the United States champion. As we can take a look here at the champions, there we are, United States champion. Somehow Dean Ambrose is the Universal Champion and Intercontinental Champion. I want to see... I kind of want to see what would happen if we tried to go to Raw as the United States Champion. I don't know... I don't know if that would work. Uh, we are pretty close to getting level 4 Company Man where we uh, have female managers, which would be awesome to have a manager. So let's see, let's see. Let's go talk to Sin Cara, see what he's got in store for us. I'm, I wish we could have the belt backstage. Are you ready for tonight? I know I am. Okay, well, that was uneventful. AJ, there's Kane. Cheesing it like some crazy person. The fires are ablaze within the depths of my soul, for I have been to the pits of hell, and I'm here to talk about it. Unless you want to follow me to Satan himself, I suggest you do not tick me off. Understood, Cain? You got it, dude. I'm uh, I'm out of here. I am out of here. Let's go see what... A oh, I thought he disappeared. Let's go see what AJ... Look at this dude. Look at his eye. He's got them dead eyes, man. He is a zombie for sure. Good luck with your match at the upcoming pay-per-view. I'll be keeping an eye on you. And if you need any help, just come find this southern boy and we'll make sure you win. I can I can appreciate that from another Southern boy. No, Renee Young. Let's uh, head this direction. See what's in store. We, hey, oh, have you heard the rumors? They say you can be the next big big thing. I, if you ask me, I think you're all right. It's not like we have not seen a superstar move like you. No one moves like me though. I'm the next big thing. Well, you you definitely got some big things. You got them things. All right, we got the seamstress. Nobody ever in the locker room. We don't care what Noam Dar says. We want to talk to Vince and get a boost. Of course, he's never freaking there. All right, let's head it in over to Todd real quick. Nikki, you got them things. Oh, I got distracted. Webster, my man. You're doing great out there. Love watching your work in the ring, you know. You're the only reason I show up anymore, Webster. There's Big E. And it looks like we can only try to go to Raw if Vince is here. Big E, what you got to say, my man? Yo, been wanting to chat with you. I've been spotting that booty backstage for a while. Yeah, I'm talking about your booty. I've been studying it. Man, what the heck? You think I've actually been looking at your ass? Come on. What? A I, don't, I don't know how to take that, Big E. What's going on in this locker room? Daniel Bryan, we're not even going to talk to you because you're just going to say the same thing. We want to play for all the cards tonight. All right, Todd, I mean, you have my full attention. Slick. Slick. There's a grand opportunity here to take everything. With Money in the Bank and last week's win, man, you can strictly dominate the WWE. So listen here. You got the title. You got a briefcase, Mr. Money in the Bank. You got an arrow aimed straight to the heart of the big ones, so let go. Get yourself, get your rock star self out there tonight, and let go. Oh, oh, my friend, it is time. It is time to shake the pillars of heaven. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Jesus. Can already feel them trembling at your coming. Do it, phrasing. All right, we're cutting a promo apparently. You know what could this, this be about? Well, Michael Cole, ooh, ooh, I will so end you. Out. All right, let's see. Right now. I should find a way to crown myself king of the WWE immediately. I have a title, I have money in the bank, and the support of the WWE Universe. This is the first step towards my dominance, and why not be on top already? I don't know about you, but I feel like I have a very little left to prove. What challenging superstar is left? I'm hoping Jinder Mahal comes out. With all the momentum I've gathered over the last couple of months, I cannot be contained. 
Wherever I want to go is where I'll go. Whatever I want is what I'll take. And life is for the plucking for me. And I couldn't be more pleased. You know, I'll keep this up and hit the afterburners, surpass my terminal velocity, and get up. You know, you know what I was going to say. When the future arrives, I know that continued wins will come with it. I'm not worried about that. Struggles exist like they always do, sure, and I'll knock them over one after the other. Some superstars grow anxious over the future, but not me. I'm willing to meet it on its own terms when it gets here and put my foot down its throat. All other champions take notice of what I'm about to say. This will be difficult for you to accept. However, the sooner you accept this reality, the less shame you'll be swallowing later after I whoop your candy asses. Give up. That probably goes against your core personality still. There was some other stuff, but just flat out give up. You hear me? We still have a journey ahead of us to complete, but let's commit to working together to take down everyone in our way. We can do this without fail. I know if I succumb, if I feel too weak, if my knees start to buckle, if my arms give out, you'll be behind my back pushing me so hard and some other stuff. And we're going to just, we're trying to end the WWE right now. All titles belong to us. Well, I figured Todd would want to have a chat. I mean, we apparently shook the pillars of heaven. Let's take a look at the match card just because. Ty Dillinger, yeah, we did a self-promotion. Heath Slater versus Baron Corbin, Kane and Connor. Wow, that's weird. Kofi and Ty. That has got to be the lamest card ever. Danny Bryan, are you in here? Just hanging out. We got Jet Draven. Hey! You got the will to back that promo up, boy? I will will you right up against this locker. I'll, mm. Can you fight Daniel Bryan? Good grief. Why can't I fight anybody? All of a sudden, we just can't do stuff. Shane, I need to talk to you, man. He's not here. Not here. Well, geez. Alright, let's get out of here. See what's coming up next. That was... Kind of a lame, kind of a lame start to this sh to this episode, but let's do it. Moving on. Okay, let's see. We got TJP. We got the construction guy. All right. Meet with Todd. Let's see what TJ has to say. You know, I heard Jack ja Gallagher talking to you about it. He was not impressed. Yeah, we're not. Uh, we're not going to do this one because he's a fan favorite and we don't care to do fan favorites. We want... Okay, okay, enough. We want a company man side quest. So let's go see if we can't hunt down a company man. Renee, lovely lady, how are you? Uh-huh. Where's Nikki? She got them things out? She got them things here tonight? Nope. Who the... Bruh. Sparta. That's my boy Sparta. Let's catch up later. Now's not the time. Um Sparta. Boy, if you don't make time for seeing Puma. Oh man. Come on now. Don't you know? Don't you know? What? Um all right, I can't do anything. And, yep, that ain't working. Oh, jeez. Just like that, Sparta's gonna grab us, throw us down. Bertha, the, the seamstress, takes off, and now we can fight. What's that about? Uh, Sparta, come on now. Can I take can I pick up this ladder? Okay, now let me pick up the ladder. You're lucky. Uh, oh my goodness. Holy cow. Sparta, you're my dude, but you got to make time for your boy in the backstage area, man. That's just how we gets down. That's just how we gets down and right now, hey. Hey man. 
Oh! Don't throw us. Oh my gosh, if we get stuck in that thing again. Such a pain. No. Just, uh. Get up. Get up, Sparta. Oh, he reversed. Man, we can reverse. Get your ass out of here. Can we take him over to this table? We can just throw him. I mean, that's the same. Oh! Smash! Holy cow. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I pick up this ladder now that it's on the floor? Really? Alright. Can't be picking up ladders, apparently. We can do this, though. And, uh! Oh, Sparta, my, my dude... Get the feet. Catch these feet. Catch these feet. Uh. Oh, jeez. Suck it too, man. You gotta be part of the Puma Nation or stuff like that happens. Oh. Get up. I don't know why it changed all of a sudden, but let's take care of Sparta. I'm sorry, my brother. Uh. -uh. No. No, that didn't do it. Okay. Dude! Look, man. Here we go. Brain Buster. That's got to do it, right? Uh, uh It doesn't. It doesn't do it. All right. Okay. Well, what if... Okay, well, I wanted the trash can, but I'll take this instead. Uh, uh Got that Ikea furniture. Bam! And... Oh... And one more to grow on since it's your birthday. I don't know. I don't know if that's true. I just assume. Let's uh, ah, uh, put this down. Put this down, Sparta, my dude. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Uh, -uh. backstabber. You got. I mean, you gotta. You gotta be nice, man. You gotta just make time for your friends. Oh, oh man, Sparta, my man. Oh, I'm sorry I had to do that, man. I'm sorry I had to do that. Nobody's ever in this locker room. We're not gonna go in there. I need some new attire ideas, like for shiz. Shinsuke, fan favorite. I noticed. Okay. So maybe because we attacked that guy, we're not gonna get a side. Vince, Vince, you have gained a buff, which will take effect in this week's match. The amount of momentum you gain will increase, your stamina recovery will increase, and the rate at which you lose stamina will decrease. Pal, this isn't the best time. If you got something to get off your chest, make it quick. I'm very busy, so make it quick. I promise I won't waste your time, just need to discuss some recent events. I think I want to change brands. Let's see what happens if this throws a kink in things. I think I need a change of pace. Yes, I made my decision. I need a change of pace. Well then, I'll get that started. Good luck to you out there. Did we just move to Raw as the United States champion? Pretty sure we did. I am pretty sure that we did. Oh, Nikki. Nikki. <laughs> Nikki. You see my beat you see that beating I put on Sparta? My boy Sparta. Let's see, what you got to say with them things? With the upcoming Alright. You do got them things though. High five. Renee Young. Let's see what. Let's just cut a promo here with Renee. Opportunities in the WWE right now are flourishing. What's next for you? Um, all the titles. Um, why would I reveal my plans? That's a good one. Think about that. Why would I reveal my plans to the WWE universe in the locker room? Don't you think I'm smarter than that? Wait, are you on their side too? Cause I will come, Renee. We'll end this. Me and you, man. We'll finish that off. You're riding high right now. Are you considered? Are you concerned that someone will take you down? Uh, no one. Uh, there we go. Something like that is so low on my list of concerns, it's almost invisible. The line is a dot to you. I've got big plans to completely conquer and dominate every facet of WWE, and there's no one who can stop it from happening. This is my house, Renee. Everyone else is just an uninvited guest, and I've turned off the boombox, and I'm throwing solo cups away 
Get out of my house. So yeah, you heard me. All right, let's go. So Vince was there. I'm going to take a shot in the dark and say Shane is here. He is. Say something about Raw. Say something about, boy, I'm leaving Raw. I'm going to hang out with Stephanie. She's cooler than you anyway. And she's... She also has them things. Maybe we can talk to freaking Mick Foley while we're there. If you say... Oh, you son of a bitch. All right. All right, Todd. What's in store for us today? Take a look at the match card. Why didn't you just say, look at the match card? Why do we always have to go to Todd? Chad Gable. Ugh. I don't care for Chad Gable. And we're about to leave this show. Uh, I mean, I could cut another promo and just say all the bad guy stuff. Let's see how close we are real quick. About 50 points, 43 points. We're way off there. For uh, Oh, we got two attribute points, though. Attribute points, though. Um, attributes. So let's put some stuff into... I want to say athleticism. Nope. Um, one of these helps. Escaping a pin. Reverse. I thought it was this one. It also increases the range of aerial attacks and springboard offense. Athleticism increases Superdog's ability to reverse. That's not the one I want. Chain wrestling gauge, meh. Mic performance. Foreign objects. Reverse opponents grapples. This is the one I want. Hit point recovery and durability. And shoot, we're only going to be able to do one. So maybe we can put this other one in promo. Yeah, we'll do that. All right. We're getting up there, man. We are getting up there. Overall, 70. I mean, our reversals and our stamina are all the way up. Our power's up as high as it can be. All right, we're getting there. So it looks like we are facing Chad Gable. Meh. All right, let's face Chad Gable. Here we go, folks, against Chad Gable, and we've made some changes to our entrance, mainly because we are... The United States champion, son. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Wait a minute. Am I coming out without the title? What the hell? I mean, you see it there, but that's on Puma's shirt. Hold up. Hold up real quick. I do not appreciate this. Where's my freaking... Ugh. We're not even going to watch Chad Gable. No. No. Not doing it. We're just going to wreck this fool. Especially after we talk to Vince. Yeah. We receive like a permanent... Like a quick buff. Did he just moan? We're going to try to end this as quick as possible because, man, how, do, how does the champ not come out without his title on, man? That's frustrating. Oh, okay. He just moved a little bit. Get stomped. Get stomped. Get stomped. Okay, get up. Uh-oh. Uh, no. Oh, my goodness. On the helmet. On the helmet, that has got to kill for Chad Gable. Nope, that, that can't feel good on your elbow either, bro. Okay, I tried to roll out. We got memorable moments for it. Oh, oh man. There, now we've rolled out. Come on out here, man. Because at this point, I don't care what happens. Uh you think I care if we get counted out? Uh, I don't. Oh, boy, get on that barricade. What did I say? 
Hey, man. Chill. Chill. Uh, e oh, okay. Alright, you know what? If we're going out, we're going out on our terms. That's that's what's happening. I mean, I'll get back in the ring, Chad. I mean, if that's what's happening here. Get your ass off of me. Dude, no. Uh, no. God dang. Leg drop from Chad Gable. Gosh. All right. I mean, you just... What? You know what? Out here, on the concrete... Uh! DDT. That's for you. You can... Oh, okay. Yeah. That was just dumb on your part. I mean, seeing Puma as the United States champion... Even though, for some reason, it is not acknowledged, I just don't understand. So, real quick, we're gonna cut. You're gonna catch these hands. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. And then you are gonna catch these feet. Oh, he did catch the feet, and he's quickly running back in. He's scared. Scared. You know what? Oh, I got that baseball bat, son. Uh. Did that not... Okay, we didn't get there. Now we'll get DQ'd. Just... Uh. Uh. No, oh, man. No, we're not stopping. Yeah. You know what? We got something... Get that camera out of my face. We got something to say. Right now. Slay the beast. Uh, yeah. I'm not in the mood to play games, so let's get right down to business. I'm trying to figure out why all of you keep cheering for the same person week in and week out when you could be cheering for me. There's a word for people like them, and it's the worst word a WWE superstar can be called in my book. Boring. Um, there we go. Here we go. Someone in the back. Look for this person and tell me if he's afraid. Do, do they look afraid? If he doesn't and they don't, then they should be. Because, my L, your worst nightmare is here. Come and face it if you dare. Are they going to come? Are they coming out? We just called out L. We called her out. That's right, L. We got we got Sparta in the backstage area. We got L coming in. This is like call central right now. All right, all right, Mama, what do you got to say? What you got to say? Sorry, I was taking a nap backstage, so I missed most of what you were saying. Could you repeat all that? Actually, don't. I'm pretty sure that's what put me to sleep in the first place. L, come on. You got to be kidding me. Um, there we go. Look, I understand your desire to be relevant around here, but coming out here and interrupting me, even though I called you out, isn't going to solve that. I don't mean to be insulting, but you're kind of boring, and the WWE Universe will agree with me on that. Seeing you in this ring right now, standing next to you, I just want to give you a knuckle sandwich. People don't think I'm a very, I'm very nice, but I'm a nice gal. I want to feed someone who's hungry. In fact, I've got knuckle sandwiches for anyone and everyone who wants one. But I'll start with you. Let's see. I've accomplished things you couldn't even do in your dreams. I am God's gift to this ring. And you, you're just God's mistake. And L, it's one that CM Puma intends to correct. You come out here every week. You try to push your weight around, show off your clout, bully people. Well, maybe I should know better, and maybe I should mind my own business, but someone needs to put you in your place, and that someone's going to be me. L. Mm. Oh. First things first, girl, you better take that bass out of your voice when you talk to me. Remember who you're in the wing with, ring with. I'm not just some punk who just got called up to the big leagues. I'm the United States champion. You best know your place and know your limitations. Because I'll take you to the brink, L. 
funny. All I've been hearing about is how great you are and how much upside you have. Then I come out, punk you, and you got nothing. Where's this superstar I heard so much about? L? Mm. Do I look like a fool? Did you honestly think that was going to work? Do I look like a fool? You think I'm going to let you come out here and trash talk me and bait me into something? The sad truth is there are two kinds of people in this world, winners and losers. And I'm a winner because I use my brains as well as my brawn. That is why when we finally face each other, some other stuff's happening, blah, 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 I'm the United States champion. So you are going to be sorry you ever opened that big mouth of yours. Whether it happens in the ring or not, I'm going to get my hands on you. And when I do, be prepared to experience pain like you've never felt before, L. Yeah, United States champion, don't play no games. Man, woman, child, seeing Puma, putting him down. You got nothing to say. You got nothing to say. Puma leaves him speechless. That's right. What you got to say about that, Todd? There were a few minor things I think we need to talk about. But overall, you were good tonight. Boy, you know... You know what? I believe... Bo Dallas. Oh, Mick! He's backstage! Oh, man, have you ever thought about changing your appearance? Actually, yes. Guys, in the comments, and gals, help. Help me change my appearance. I need some ideas. Hey, thanks for stopping by, but I have other stuff other stuff to take care of. Can I punch McBoley in his face and knock out some more teeth? I guess not. I guess not, but Mick Foley backstage at SmackDown. Oh, man. I think the... Uh, the next place we're stopping is Raw, and it looks like we're already here. That lady looking for Steph. The big dog, Roman Reigns. You know that pay-per-view that's coming up? Well, watch your back. Even when you already have a match lined up, you never know if a superstar will hit you with a surprise attack. We're in a vicious business where it's always best to watch out for yourself. Is that some sort of threat, Roman? Can I punch him in the face? No. This is my girl right here. Mm, mm, mm. Hey, hey. You look real tired there. Maybe I recommend a coffee or two. As soon as you close an eye, especially in the ring, someone will take you down. Stay up. Stay woke. I, I don't think stay woke. I don't think that's the right way you use stay woke. Come on now. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. We did a couple of things. We backstage brawled with Sparta, a buddy of mine from Instagram. We had a match with Chad Gable. We switched to Raw, apparently. As the United States champion, we called out L. From Revel Revolution, I'll leave her uh, her channel down in the description. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. So if you enjoyed what you saw, please leave a like. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Hit the little bell to get the notifications. Hey, CM Puma's posted another video. That would be fantastic. So in the next episode, we start out on Raw. See where we go from there. I'll see you soon.